I ate it for refusing to take my brother and his pregnant wife in after he told me to abort my son. IF28 was five weeks pregnant with my son Jack when my husband got involved in an auto accident that left him on ventilator for a few days then he passed away. This absolutely ended me. I was going through the worst days of my life I had to go to the hospital. I was suffering from anemia because I didn't eat for two days following the funeral. I felt tired, weak and pale all the time. My family who hated my husband especially my brother showed up at the hospital and starting talking about my health and how the pregnancy was probably causing this. And he told me I should consider abortion since being a new widow. Having health problems weren't suitable condition to raise a child in. I was in disbelief. I knew he hated my husband and hated that I was pregnant with his baby so he brought up abortion to get rid of him preeminently. I was so mad. I asked him how could he expect me to let go of the last piece I have of my husband who was taken from me all of a sudden. I told him how my husband was so excited to be a dad and how much this meant to him. I called him selfish and insensitive for even thinking about it and I cut contact with him after that. Now my son is three months old. There isn't a day that goes by that I don't wish that my husband was here with us. It's so unfair and my son didn't deserve not having his dad around. Last week, my mom called me. She started talking about my brother's financial struggles and how his could no longer pay for rent because his work project that he put money got cancelled. She suggested that he and his pregnant wife could come stay at my place for a couple of months till he figured out something. She said she has no room for them in her house because she already has her niece stay with her after she and her husband divorced. I told her that I couldn't let him live with me after he blatantly told me to get abortion just out if spite and hate for my husband. I told her how hurt I felt and how difficult it was to realize that my son was rejected by him and now he wants to be part of my and my son's life. My mom lashed out saying that I should let go of the past and that I can't just refuse to let his pregnant wife in and cause them to be homeless. I told her no, but she tried to argue and pressure me into saying yes. I hung up on her but she kept calling to shame me and guilt trip and say that I was being cruel and selfish. NTA. I don't know your financial situation. Obviously. But you are a new widow with a three-month-old baby. You deserve to protect your peaceful home while you grieve and raise your baby alone. Don't give your brother's plight another thought. And you should continue to hang up on her. How would your brother feel if you told him to abort his baby because being broken nowhere to live is no way to bring up a child? My husband got involved in an auto accident that left him on ventilator for a few days then he passed away. This is tragic. I'm terribly sorry. The pregnancy was probably causing this. And he told me I should consider abortion since being a new widow. Having health problems weren't suitable condition to raise a child in. Never mind that this is an abhorrent thing to say. It also doesn't make any logical sense. If the pregnancy were causing your health problems, then your health problems would be resolved once the pregnancy was complete. And then you wouldn't be raising a child in an unsuitable condition. Not that I agree with his logic in the first place. But he doesn't sound like he's firing from all cylinders here. I knew he hated my husband. I have to ask, why did your family dislike your husband so much? My mom called me. She started talking about my brother's financial struggles and how his could no longer pay for rent. Uh, boo-hoo. I mean, not to be churlish, I'm sure it's an awful situation for him to be in, but he hasn't earned a thing from you. My mom lashed out saying that I should let go of the past and that I can't just refuse to let his pregnant wife in and cause them to be homeless. Then she can suck it up, make some room, and shelter them herself. NTA NTA He doesn't respect your choices. 
Family is important but your brother didn't respect that with regards to your husband. You don't know them a roof. If you are e e e e e e e e e e e e a l l y wanted to be petty you could recommend them an abortion. Then his homeless wife wouldn't be pregnant. She kept calling to shame me and guilt trip and say that I was being cruel and selfish. He told me I should consider abortion since being a new widow. Having health problems weren't suitable condition to raise a child in. Double standards much. Fuck that bullshit. How does your brother get to be selfish and cruel? Even if this all hadn't happened you don't owe it to anyone to house them. The only people you're responsible for are yourself and your baby. You Aaron responsible for your brother and his wife. You are NTA. I am so sorry for your loss. NTA your brother can solve his own problems. NTA. Why would you jump from not speaking to someone to suddenly living with them? That's insane. You are still grieving your husband and you have a three-month-old child. You definitely don't need to add any stress or drama to your home. Your mother should not be acting as a middleman between her grown children. If she continues to bring it up, tell her you will not be discussing it further and hang up. I hope you can take comfort in your child and I wish you all the peace heart. NTA and info why did he have your husband so much? NTA. He and his pregnant wife can find a stable. I hear something similar apparently worked out for somebody else once. NTA. First of all, I want to say sorry for your loss. As for your brother, what he said to you was awful. He had no business telling that to you. I know he told you you should abort because of health reasons. But I seriously doubt that was his real reason. And your mom needs to lay off with the guilt tripping. I wish you and your son well. Info. Why did your family hate your husband? Did something happen between your brother and husband? Info. Why did your family hate your husband? Info. Has your brother made any form of groveling apology since? And how was your relationship with him before the accident? NTA. He said an absolutely awful thing to you. And then couldn't even be bothered to apologize or even ask for this favor himself. He had your mom do it. Definitely NTA. Or in no way should you. A single parent of an infant cohabit with your bro and his pregnant wife. The stress it would cause you. My god, you are 100,000% NTA for saying no. Your bro is the asshole for how he spoke to you and your mom a bit as well for not supporting you. Guilting you to let him move in. That's crazy. Sorry for what you've been going through. Take care of yourself and baby and don't feel bad about letting your brother manage his own housing. Issues. NTA. He didn't offer you any real emotional support after your husband passed away. Which I am very sorry about. Now he is asking to support him in the same situation you were in. Facing real struggle with a baby on the way. I totally understand why you would not want to help him. NTA actions have consequences and why should you financially support someone who is cruel to you? You haven't been in contact for some time. If he wanted to work on the relationship he could have done so sooner than this. Secondly how is his financial situation only going to be temporary this is a global pandemic that may last for some time you're looking at being the breadwinner for some time. Even if you were close having to support three new mouths to feed is extremely difficult and too much for most new parents let alone a widower. So NTA, if it's a cell phone send your mother directly to VM and preemptively do the same for your brother and his wife. You are neither cruel or selfish. Your family as a whole however are. NTA. Your husband left you the most precious gift, his son. Anybody who knows your situation and say even mildly negative thing about your son would be a total. In my book, 
your brother went far far further. Your mother should take your brother in and help him since she does not see a problem with his statements about your son. She is his parent, not you. NTA. Your brother is toxic. Having him and his pregnant wife around are no condition to raise your son in. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.